hot diggity dogs. Got another high-end booster box battle here. We are cracking open ultimate freaking masters. This is gonna be juicy, man. These are almost what well, they five. I know they're about 550, maybe into the 600 range. I can't recall exactly what I paid, but these are almost $600 now a box. Unfreaking believable. Had to get my scissors. Sorry about that, y'all. So here we go. You guys ready to battle? Let's do this. We got Brett, Greg, Ian, James, John, Keegan, Marcus, Rich, Sam, Sean, and Double Steve. Let's get into this. Let's get ready to battle. All right, Aiden, who's going to win this one? Ooh, that looks so freaking nice. Box topper. Brett. Brett's going to win it? Brett's going to win it. First off rip. Brett's going to win it all. All right, we're going to see, man. <laughs> Good luck, everybody. May the value forever be on your side. TCG player market value pricing will determine the outcome of the winner. Whoever has the most value is going to win. $1 and up. Is all, or a dollar and up will be factored in if it's common or uncommon. There's two commons that are valued over, uh, are yeah valued over a dollar, and there are about oh my gosh, 15, 13, 13 uncommons valued over one buck. Foils have to be bucking up, and also every rare and or mythic will also be factored into this. Good luck, gentlemen. No ladies in this one today. Good luck, gentlemen. I hope someone freaking hits it big. I hope the box topper brings the, the spoils of war here. And uh, we just freaking have a blast in the process. Each person's getting two beautiful packs of Magic the Gathering Ultimate Mastery cards. Where are there still a crap ton of value in these, man? This is just as good as Double Masters. Double Masters has a slight of an edge, uh, but these man with the box toppers are a real nice little treat. Let's get ready to battle. Brett is up first. Brett, freaking good luck. All right, here we go. We got the pull tab. Oh, man, the, the, the terrible pull tabs. All right, you say Brett. I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with Stephen A is going to win it all. Here we go. Mmm. Ooh, ooh, that's right. We go like this. We go like this. I forget. Is that a foil? Yeah, that's a foil, but you can't even freaking tell, man. All right, that is a foil. Maelstrom Paul, start things off for Brett. Looking pretty weak. Sorry, Brett. My son does not know how to pick him. Here we go. Eternal Witness. I think that's over four bucks. Or no, that's 352. Good lord. Nice. Okay. And then we got ourselves the Grave Strength with Rolling Tambor. Okay. And the common slot member, there's only two cards that are over uh, that are bucking up. And I don't believe I see him right here. Sorry, fell, fella. Wait, what was the other one? Let me just do a recap. The other one, I know the one is the reach. The other one's frantic search. Okay, easy, easy peasy. Greg's up next. Already, Brett, you're probably gonna lose. So just just know that. Sorry, Tupac said so. Here we go. I gotta bust your chops. My dad used to bust mine because I like Tupac. Here we go. Kitchen Finks. There you go. Fun little foil. Oh, host of herons showing on up. Uh, sweet, beautiful angel. Mm. She can hook me with whatever that's called any time of day. I don't know what that, I can't think of what it's like called. Uh, Cigar is showing up. Everything gets sleeved that's valuable, just so you guys know. Shriek Maw, hero of Atawa. Okay. She's not over a buck, though, no. And then we got Apprentice Necromancer. Wow. Okay, that one's counting. Cool. A lot of value in the uh, common, or uh, any uncommon slot. Really, really is. All right, and nothing going on there. So, Greg takes the commanding lead. But will that last? Has anyone else done this with magic? Like, does anyone else play this way? You ever, like, battle it out, you know, or whatever? Um... I think it's a blast, man. I think it's a freaking blast. Patrons love it, too. Daybreak Coronat. That is actually a pretty nice little foil. You can barely tell the foils on these. Dig Through Time. Ooh, you just got pounded. All right. A little Dig Through Time action with the recovery. Oh. You know who that looks like? What's his name? The Rock? A little bit. Uh, nah, maybe? I don't know. A little bit of Rock action going there. All right. And for this... Nothing again? No. But we got to go through them, though, because there is some value there. 
I think the funnest part about doing battles is when I price the videos. It is a lot of work, I'll tell you that. But I felt it was the best and most professional way to do a battle. I've tried other ways, and I'm just not a fan of the other ways. I think it's just kind of shortcutting the audience. And uh, you don't really, what do you get to know? Nothing. You don't get to know nothing. Here you get to know the prices of what the cards are going for at the current time of the recording. Eldrazi Conscription. There you go, James. Not doing a whole lot for you, though. Um, yeah, so oh, yeah, I didn't say Ian last time. But I just think it's, I think it's a better way to go about them. Again, I have tried other routes, but just, the audience is more informed. I like my audience knowing the value of cards. If you guys haven't noticed that yet, that's kind of what the channel focuses on. Um, it is the pricing of the cards. Um, we like to know what's going on. So there you have it. Then we got just the wind. Okay. Come on. What else? What else? Ah, Ulamog's Crusher. Okay. Nothing crazy. John Cena is up. John, good freaking luck. Let's kick the tires, light the fires, baby. I love opening Ultimate Masters. I remember cracking through these. I remember destroying a freaking foil tarmac wife when it was like 250 bucks. Oh, whoops. Soul's Fire. Oh, Revel Arc. Yeah. I'm not going to cut it, dude. Sorry, John Cena. There we go. Uh, the Planes. Sleight of Hand. Nice. I'm not going to count that. Whoops. Buried Alive. Most expensive, uncommon. Holy crap, does that pack the freaking punch. Nice freaking Buried Alive there. Can we get a common worth a damn? I think it's next pack. It's next pack. Okay, next pack. We'll get it. So, John, there you go. I mean, that big uncommon pool, That's that could help you win this. Also, if a battle is ever decided within $1, I give uh, the loser a little something, too. So, that's the only time a loser gets anything. Olivia's Dragoon. Demonic Tutor. Sick bastard. There you go, Keegan. Smack him, Keegan. Get him. Right in the meat hook. Mmm. Massacre him, demon boy. Hey, hey, hey. We got a Demonic Tutor. That's freaking spicy. I hate that word. I keep saying it, though. It's really annoying me. Okay. Then we got uh, Numbra Worm. Blast of Genius. Rise from the Tides. Cool art on that guy. All right. Can we hit it? I said this pack was going to have the common value. Can I do it? Did I call it? No. Well, my psyche's off today. Nice pack there, Keegs. Uh, we have Marcos on deck. We got a battle. I see two people with some big freaking value. They're leading it off. But hey, all it takes is one massive freaking pool. And this whole thing turns around like that, baby. We got turn to miss. Ooh. You know, Marcos, you should probably quit entering these battles. Because, man, you are losing bad. Disrupting no value. Fiend Hunter. Garna. Blood Flame. And we got some Faith Fetters. All right, all right, all right. Come on, do we have any value here? No, no common value. All right, we got Richie Rich. Rich Rich M, I should say. Rich M. I had one break where we had four Tylers in one break. I'm like, slow down. How many Tylers? Listen, quick giving birth to these kids named Tyler, all right? And now to knock it off. Just kidding, don't do that. Have more Tylers. Tylers. The more Tylers on Bad Boy Gaming, the better, if you ask me. Engineered Explosives. Yay. I have two of these box toppers in BGS 9.5. Still not certain that was a good buy. But, uh, free freaking dope. Nice pool for Rich. Desperate Ritual. All the Tylers just left my Patreon. Every freaking one of them. Are you serious? Yeah. I, I just got, yeah, notif- Oh, up, oh, up. Oh. One just joined and he's gone. Yeah, they all left. Well, what are you gonna do? Awkward. What the heck is this? Sacrifice, Terra Market Expand. Search your library for a basic land card. Find a battlefield tip and shelf your library. That card's trash. What the heck? Dude, sorry, you're not getting that. All right, Foil is up next. Verdant Eidolon. Come on, baby. Give him something to talk about. Nothing. That Engineer Explosives, though. Rich, not bad. I think Engineer Explosives might be between 7 and 15. I know the last time I did one of these breaks or uh, openings, the price was low. It was like 8 or $9. And I'm like, that's crazy low. Vexing Devil. Some value there. Vexing Devil. 
but it should be up now. Stam, son. Vexing Devil uh, with a Buried Alive. That's some freaking value, dude. Not crazy through the roof, but maybe, well, 10, 10 bucks or so sitting pretty. Sigil of the New Dawn, Forbidden Alchemy. There you have it. How about a Counter Squall to one of those guys? All right, can we get some common value for once in our life? The answer is no. No, we cannot. All right, Sean T. Sean T, good freaking luck. May Liliana's bongos rest on your chin. Here we go. Oh, I saw that. You saw that? We saw that. Mm, let's give it an early bird special. Phyrexian freaking tower. Juicy little hit there, man. Nice little Phyrexian tower. That card's sick. All the way from Urza. I know, it's nuts. All right, Mage Ring Network with Chainer's Addict. Is that one over a few bucks? Probably not, huh? I think it was, but not anymore. No, it is. Yeah, it's like five. It's like five thirty-seven. I had a feeling that was a good one. Urban Evolution, Cathodian popping up. Give me a freaking, a freaking card over a buck in the comments, man. Slap at you, slap at you, bros. Nothing. I need that frantic search. All right, Sean, that was not bad. That was decent. Steven's up next. Steven, are you gonna pull that fat mythic? Here we go. And got sure. Oh, pattern of rebirth. No. That's all right, man. That's all right. You'll live to see another day. Dawn Charm, Wild Hunger, and Artisan of Kozilek shows up. Okay, Fiery Temper. We need to hit one. One common, please. One common value card, please. Please, please. Nothing. Okay. Uh, you guys check out my uh, the, the uh, Antique Mall video. I thought that was fun. And I've been getting a lot of really good feedback from that Antique Mall uh, video where I'm hunting magic cards. A lot of you seem to enjoy that style video. So if that's the case, definitely let me know. Maybe I'll go out and do another hunt, you know. But I promise, whether I find something or not, I'll, I'll try to give you a good laugh. I'll, I'll, and I'll try to make it enjoyable like I did that video. And I will always open something magic at the end. Whether or not I find, you know, well, if I find something magic, we're going to just show it and you know, whatever. Uh, and go through it later, but... If not, uh, I'll I'll purchase something. And I'll try to do it from a local game store, too. There we go. Uh, big crap for freaking who we on. Stephen L. We went through that quick. Stephen L. Man, Stephen A didn't get... Did, Stephen A got something, right? He got something. Okay. Okay, we're better. Anger and Living Lore. There's Frantic Search. About bloody freaking time, mate. Finally shows up. That'll get the bell. Most expensive. Freaking... Why did I put these over here? Sorry, guys. I got a little sloppy for a second i don't know why i put these over here probably gotta do a little bit of a talking mode okay there we go now we're back on track that does not go there <laughs> give me one second just to collect uh collect my thoughts on this i gotta move these okay you guys go in this pile thank you and you do too okay now we're back on track so there's where the totals are at right now we can do better let's go to brett brett your last pack aiden your dude's up, man. Your, your, your bro's up. Here he goes. Here he goes. Travel. What's he going to get? It's all comes down to this card here. All is dust. That's some value. But probably not going to cut it. <laughs> so we're just going to drop this deuce right here. Lava Spike pops up. Cool. Hero, Devoted Druid. And that's about it, man. Well, <sighs> looks like Brett's a loser. The wife's probably already got his bags on the porch. <laughs> the kids are in her name. We'll see you, Brett. Nice to know you. You're going to do Brett like that. How <laughs> you going to do Brett like that? <laughs> <laughs> Greg. Greg's up next. Here we freaking go. Greg's up next. What do you got, Greg? Something big, man. Thespian stage foil. That's uh, worth noting. Nothing nuts, though. And then we got Seize the Day. Wow. He's got a bloody sword. He's seen some battles. Heap hole, Drake, and Angel of Despair, the cheapest, if I'm not mistaken, of the cards that qualify to be in the bucket up slot. We still have, oh, there's Kadama's Reach. I'm like, we still haven't pulled Kadama. And then we finally do. So a little bit of common value for you. Hopefully that holds you over. Okay. Ian's up next. He wants to get himself a six pack of chicken nuggets from McDonald's. Can he do it? We're going to find out. If he wins this battle, he definitely could. He definitely could. Get the Happy Meal, though. Comes with those fun toys. They were just doing Mario Kart freaking toys 
And the Happy Meals. What? Sonic. Sonic. No, that no. This is like two weeks ago. Oh. Um. Yeah, we got Sonic the other day. What was it? Tails. Yeah. Yeah. Containment Priest. Oh, sorry, pal. Sorry, she didn't rub your wick. Mm -mm, nope. Unstable. Whispers and Jin. Yeah, but I want to just purchase on eBay every single one of those Mario Kart toys. I thought that was really neat. I'm a dork. Okay. Okay. Moving along here. Who doesn't like Mario Kart? Like for real? Yeah. You like Mario, Mario Kart? Mario Kart 64. Yeah. We got games here um, on the, uh, what's it called? Um, what the hell is it? Super Mario Party's good, too. We got all that stuff over there in the corner. Maybe we should play some Mario Kart later. Thalonix Leader. Big one. Oh, Noah High Arc. Not bad. I can't remember what he pulled last time, but uh, that's, that is some value. I know it ha she has come down in price, but still a good freaking hit. And then we got the artist. We need a massive... Ooh, on burial rights. We need a massive mythic. There's frantic search. Can we get the double whammy? No. Okay. Down to John. Sorry, James. I don't know if you were. I don't know. Hey, I have no idea who's gonna win this one. We had, I think, three people that had a notable pool, like twenty to forty buck range, and then uh, some other duds. Moan of the Unhallowed. Sick art right there. That's a foil. Craziness. Oh, Sky Summoner, John Cena has done the worst. Oh, it stings, man. I'm so sorry. John, sorry, man. Nice maniac. Nice maniac, though. There's going to be a lot, of, a, a lot of value, I'd say, going home with someone. There's another Kadama's Reach. No double whammy common pack. Okay. Keegan's up. Come on, Keister. Show him how to do this, baby. Didn't Keegan get something nice, I think? I think Keegan got a big hit. Okay. There's Angelic Renewal. Very cool. Big one. Big one. Ancient freaking tomb. <laughs> how you like them apples? Who do you think's going to win now? Whoever makes applesauce. <laughs> <laughs> Whoever makes applesauce. Songs are the damned cool looking card there. And who I think is going to win now? Oh, man. I, I stay loyal, bro. Stephen A is going to win this. He's going to get that sick-ass friggin' mythic pool, and it's going to be game I over. I go Stephen L. Stephen L? Oh, you want a flip mode, huh? You know, flip, old flip mode is the greatest. <laughs> All right, here we go. Marcos, who I think was pummeled in the first pack. Will he get his guts beat up again? Time will tell. Grave Scrabbler. Maybe we had good scrambled eggs this morning, huh? We did. I finally didn't overcook them. And spoils of the vaults. Not gonna do it for Marcos. We'll see you later, alligator. And then we got Phoenix with Mystic Retrieval. Can flag a rape, sure. Okay. Oh, Rune Snag. Give him a double common whammy. Bastard. Nothing. Marcos, another one bites the dust. We'll see you. You're cut. Rich. All you got to do is pull a sick, freaking, filthy mythic right now. Someone's going to hit a, a fat mythic. It's coming. It's going to be Stephen L. Okay. Daybreak Coronet. I hope you're right. No, I don't. Here we go. But that'd be cool. World Heroes Helix. Deckmore Salvage. And the old spider. Any spiders over five bucks? I'm going to get some spider tribal going. Here we go. Frantic Search. We got one. Can we do the double? Oh my God, double it up, double it up, double it up. Oh, Sam, or not Sam, Rich is like, I don't care, dude, shut the hell up. <laughs> Unsubbed. Just actually <laughs> dislike on this video. Wait, that was that was for Rich. Okay, so now we're on Sam. Oh, yeah, okay, screw it. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Sammy boy, here we go. Oh man. Woo! All right. I'm feeling something good for Sam. Watch this. Oh, come on, something big. Boom! Fucking snappy all day. All of that face. There you go. I felt it, man. Oh, God, that's good. Your dad's got that magical little freaking crystal ball, man. But it wasn't Steve A. Steven A. That was a Sammy. That was Sam. I know, but it wasn't Steven. I had a cat named Sam once. <laughs> was on a counter squall. Double tap in that ass. All right, there you go. There you go, man. Counter squall pounding. Okay. Furnace celebration and become immense. Hmm. Good times. Can we get the double trouble? Son, will you, will you kindly dispose of this card in the trash? Sure. Thank you. Are you serious? 100%. Uh, okay. I want to hear the sound of it rip as well. 
Okay. Come, come close, come close. Come close. Okay, let's hear it, let's hear it. Oh, now throw it in front of everyone. We don't play that shit around here. <laughs> you, you want me to throw that in the trash now? No, let's leave it there. Okay. We need people to know. <laughs> we're sending we're sending a message here. <laughs> sending a message here. Snappy, you okay? Snappy, you okay? Excuse me. Excuse me, let me cover Snappy. He didn't need to see that. Oh, Snappy's in, Snappy's minty. Okay, good. Snappy's fine. Here we go, baby. Sean's up. What's he gonna get? What's he gonna get? Right now, a soy boy somewhere is crying over that. Zombie. Stitch Drake. Oh, man. This has been a really good break. A really good opening so far. Come on, come on. Reanimate. Nice. That's some good value. Sean's like, yeah, but not enough, Dick. Okay, true, true. <laughs> that's that's true, but you're, you're still here. Mm-hmm. Boneyard Worm and the Thalonyx. Can we get any more value out of this little slot? Neat, 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 neat. And the answer is no. My boy. What's up, homie? Let's go, player. Show me some of that gold. Here we go. Doing big things. Let's see who does better, Steven or Boots and Benson, Boots and Benson, and Boots and Defy gravity. Oh man. Call comes down to this right here for Steven. Fudge. <laughs> Cat ourselves a fauna shaman. Good card. But unfortunately, that's a slippery boggle. So there you go. You are out the running for this magnificent break here. Are young Pyromancers over a buck still? No. Unfortunately not. Think twice. Double common pack? Not a chance. And now we have the last pack. And then out of the box hopper. Can we get some sweet Lily? We pulled her last video. It was amazing. Well, she was great. She was, she was, she was dressed nice. Spirit. <laughs> Shriek Ma. Come on, Steven. Raging Ravine. Yeah, dude. All right, not going to do it. Box got a little weak there at the end. I would have liked to have seen some bigger hits, but hopefully this box topper is really going to come through. We had some, some solid pulls, but nothing really that just like shook the table other than my son walking around. So let's see what we get here. <laughs> it's okay. We don't get it. Okay. <laughs> box topper. Box Was topper. Liliana? Maybe. Maybe. Here we go, guys. Good luck. Congrats to the winner. Here's what you're taking home. Got to be really careful with these. Oh, can we not split that like that? Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, why are you doing this to me? Okay. Be something juicy. Is there something juicy? I don't know. Can't tell. Can't tell. Oh my god! Dude just broke the box! Holy shit! Wham! Best card you can pull in the entire set. Period. What the? <laughs> Bro. I was looking to buy one of those. BGS 9.5. It was like 800 bucks. Yeah. Dang. Oh my God. Wow. I've always wanted to open this card. You guys have no freaking idea. Wow. Hold up. Wow, dude. Congratulations to the freaking winner. Holy hell. Wow. <laughs> best Ultimate Masters box opening. It went from it went from subpar to like the best <laughs> Ultimate Masters box opening ever. Oh my god, that was so freaking cool, man. Wow. Uh I don't even have to pull up on this because I don't care about the uh the rares and stuff because I know all the pricing. I thought at least. Um I was just talking to him. All right, wow, holy crap, guys. Um that was a freaking real cool experience. Um I can't believe it. That seriously was freaking dope. Cracks of the cavern, baby. Oh my god. 
tastes good too. Uh,